Okay guys, I'm back with part two. If you've not already watched part one, go down and watch it. This is part two of my mammoth haul. I have done a lot of shopping recently. I explained that in the first video. So I'm literally just gonna jump in and we're gonna start speaking about the clothes. So I have packages here from Topshop, ASOS, Nasty Gal, and I'm just gonna show you what I picked up. I mentioned in the first video that I wasn't gonna do a try on today. Um, partly the reason that there's just so much stuff and I don't really have time for it, unfortunately. But all my outfits will be posted on my Instagram. I will style them up in certain ways and you will get to see them over there. So make sure you're following me there. But the second reason is more just because like the room that I try on all my outfits is an absolute mess at the moment because we're in the process of redecorating a house so we've got like paint brushes and we've got our washing in there like it, all that kind of stuff so it's just a bit of a mess at the moment but once the new house is all ready I will have a cute little filming space and I'll be able to show you all my outfits perfectly and aesthetically so yeah very excited for that but honestly shut up and just get into the film okay right here we go let's start with Top Shop I have not opened these yet. So these are first impressions. My idea for a lot of these things was I want pieces that are really versatile, that I can wear out and about, out for drinks, casual, and just style them up in different ways, as well as going to uni, things like that. So my first piece is perfect for that sort of um, vibe. It is a little skirt. Again, A-lined my thing with the ring pool detailing down the front in this beautiful tan colour which this is £29 I really really like it I didn't know like how I would feel about this colour because I liked it online and I was like you know what I don't know if it's a, if it's a colour that I would wear Ooh, it would go really well with this t-shirt but yeah I just I love it it's so different for me but I think like of course I'm gonna wear black turtleneck or something with it you know for uni or something to make it more me but again this black turtleneck paid a converse like I will be rocking it at uni I love it but then I could also put a nice top on with it pair of heels and your per your set for the evening like so nice also picked up a pair of jeans so like I said I'm trying to expand my jean collection further than Joni jeans so I picked up some Dree jeans. They're, these are cropped kick flares. I bought these in petite. I am five. I'm five foot two, so I wanted to get the petite ones, so they actually are cropped. But they've got a nice um, frayed hem, and in this lovely light denim blue colour. Yeah, I love a kick flare. I think it's really flattering on me because I am so short. To go with that, I thought this would go really well. So this is a sort of pajama style top blouse shirt thing uh, from Topshop, £35, very floaty, silky material, really really nice. Like I said, I'm not really a fan of floral prints but like, like this one, it's quite subdued and the colours are dark and vibrant which is something I like. If it's too... I have no examples because I, I wouldn't buy it if I didn't like it. but. Do you know what I mean by too florally? I don't like that. But this, I think, is really, really cool and really eye-catching. And I think with a pair of jeans, a pair of heeled boots, or heels actually for a night out, would look lovely. Even tucked into a denim skirt would just look so, so classy. Right, next we'll move on to Nasty Gal. We have a another sort of top that has your flute sleeves, your wrap it around sort of tie at the front bow tie stuff in this bold black, orange and white print. I'm not sure. I love it. I think it's really cool, but I don't know if it's me. And I don't know if it's something that if it was in my wardrobe I'd pick up and wear. But let me know what you think. It's just the colours. Orange is just so, so vibrant for me. I can wear the sorts of Jude orange, but that, that shit bright. That shit is bright. It is really nice though. I'm torn. Let me know what you guys think. This looks similar to something I've already bought. But. Ooh, 
okay, these are cool. Forgot about these. So these are a pair of trousers, wide leg trousers, I think, in a very soft, floaty material. But I think these are going to be quite see-through. But they're so cool. They're in a spoy yellow and white print, long, you know, floaty legs. Oh, I really like these. I just, I think they're going to be too see-through. And actually. I'm not actually sure that will go over my hips, but we will see. There is a zip. Oh, I hope these work. I hope these aren't see-through. But I do think they're going to be see-through because I can see the tag through them when I'm... I can see the tag from the other side. That's a real shame. Yeah. I like these. These are cool. I'm keeping these. I've not had a pair of sunglasses like this yet. I've wanted ones for ages, but these went down in the sale. I think that's why I picked them up. Again, I couldn't justify paying the price that shops were charging for them. Had they been in like Primark or something for a couple quid, I'd have had a pair of these already. Love them, tortoise shell sunnies in that sort of cat eye, sort of retro y style, which I think is really cool. Very in at the moment. I have a little two piece here. So, this is the top. Got the little top like so it's a very like it's a little beige number with black and white stripes down it and it buttons at the front if you can tell like so quite cute quite cute only thing is for me is I'm not sure how it will fit on around my boobs not that I have many not that I have many not that I have much but it can be a struggle sometimes I need a six normally for my body, but sometimes that doesn't give me much room in the boobage area. But we'll see. And the bottoms to go with that. So we've now got the little tan bottoms. Let's zip them up. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, they did look really cute. Again, these are wide legs. Like so. Oh, do you know what? I really like this. But I've noticed that... There's a hole. How sad. Kind of makes me think it's so close to the zip that somebody's like caught it. Like maybe they've had this on, like someone else bought it and they put it back, but they couldn't get it off or something. Cause it's like, like the, it's caught on the zip and ripped. I think that's what's happened there. Well, that's a shame. I'd have been keen to give that a go, but oh well, I put it back and saved money. So it's all a win-win here. I also got, what are you, some trousers? I bought some, I think it's like paper bag style trousers, khaki sort of colour, again wide leg, very much like wide leg trousers, when, uh, wide leg trousers when it comes to trousers, yes, with a massive buckle uh, belt on it which I think is really cool, however this is the strangest material, it feels like I used to go, I went to Air Cadets for like a couple months, couldn't hack it, but we had to wear like the green overalls when we were doing like outside shiz, like running about and you know like army style, but like, do you know what I mean? The sort of things you do, like, you know what I mean though, don't you? That's what this feels like, like what I had to wear then. Doesn't really feel like a trouser material or a trouser material that you'd wear for fashion. Guys, this, this isn't going well, is it? I'm not going to keep them, I don't think. I'm really disappointed so far. Well, no, Topshop's good. Topshop's good, Nasty Gal so far is not doing well for me. But they've got one last chance to make it up. I bought a little skirt. Love skirts for uni. I've spoken about how to style the other ones. So I just like casual things, you know, you can chuck on, but your outfit doesn't look the same all the time. We have this little skirt. So this is actually quite similar to the top I'm wearing. Black, white and black and white stripes on the orange, the muted orange -y brown coloured skirt. This honestly has, this one has potential. This one I might like. Again, I just hope it's not see-through. Could be see-through. Guys, what's it with your see-throughness? See-through, see-through, see-throughness, see-throughness? Jesus Christ, I need to go back to uni. But yeah. I like it. It's got the buttons, tortoise, tortoise shell buttons down front, got your ties at the waist, like so, 
floaty, quite, it's quite long actually. If you're a taller person, you'd get away with it. I think that's really nice. I'm just hoping that it'll fit and it isn't see-through. But again, like with a pair of tights on in winter, I'm not going to be wearing that without tights. So, you know, it might work and I'm quite excited about that one. So thank you, Nasty Gal, for giving me something I actually quite like. Uh, and finally, we have ASOS. Oh my god, guys, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Empty my bag first. Let's start with this. I bought two pairs of earrings. The other ones I have worn and I'm not actually sure where I put them. So I can't show you them. But this pair, they were quite similar to this. So I can explain what they were like. But oh, my neck, it's a lot of packaging. Right, so I bought some earrings. And I don't have white earrings and I just thought, do you know what, like that could look so freaking cool with a bright coloured top, even with black, just to give you that pop of something. Yeah, I think they're well ace. Yum. They look like little people, don't they? <laughs> but yeah, I bought quite similar ones to this, again, they were like shapes, but different shapes. And it was like a bright orange and I just thought they were really really cool again to give that pop of something to your outfit. Love them. Okay so this top was actually bought prior to the other one, the other leopard print top from my other haul that I got from I saw it first. I bought this one out of panic because I knew what I, I knew the style that I wanted to go for and I just couldn't find it anywhere. Bought this and then realized that I liked the other one that I found better. So I think I will put this one back. Not that it's not a nice top, I just don't need another leopard print top. Even though this one is slightly different, it's obviously a different colour, different sort of pattern. Well, it's, it's still leopard print, isn't it? But it's cute. Again though, like it's wrap around, low neck, um, low cut. That's what the word I was trying to look for. Top that you would need a little bralette or something underneath. And I just don't need another top like this. But if you are searching for a leopard print top and you maybe don't like let like actual brown leopard print this might be a good alternative for you because it's like a really muted pink it's actually really really nice i actually really like that but like i said i'm a student now i can't afford to keep two very similar tops so yeah that's all i can really say about that one Ooh. I think this was from, okay, I missed something from Nasty Gal, so we're just going to jump back to Nasty Gal. I saw this on the website and thought it was really cool. I don't know if it's going to sue me. So essentially, it is a star choker. And anyone that knows me, or I hope you guys do as well, I love stars, like my whole sort of blogging aesthetic. It's about star, like revolved around star. So... I thought that was really cool. Um, I'm now a bit worried that like I'd like slice my throat if I got like one caught. But let's see. What do you guys think? Kind of cool. I'll see. I'll let you try it on with some outfits and make up my mind. But yeah, back on to ASOS. I got a denim skirt. I already have a black denim skirt. I suppose you can't have too many. This one is A-line. My other one isn't A-line. And is has got the tortoise shell buttons down the front. Don't know if you can tell, but I quite like the style at the moment. Uh, yeah, that's really cute actually. This is from New Look on ASOS. So it'll be very affordable, I'm sure. Yeah, I think that's really cute. And ASOS uh, New Look normally fits me really well, so I think that's gonna be a really nice little skirt that will go with every single top that I have bought and shown you in this haul as well as the majority of my wardrobe and will be absolutely perfect for uni, for a night out and customising in every single way possible. So I will look forward to styling that and you will see how I do that on my blog and Instagram. Follow that Instagram. So picking on skirts, I am stocked up for a while. I have another denim skirt. This one is ASOS own this time in petite. I got a size 8 and it is in this rusty orange colour. I think that's so cool. Again, that would go really well with what I'm wearing at the moment. And it would go really well with black, a little white tee, a little slogan tee. It would look really cute with that. A pair of Converse, heel boots, 
boots in general, Chelsea boots would look really cool with that. I love it. I just hope it fits. It's got sort of cut out detailing here, which is quite different to any of the skirts that I already own. So I quite like that little detailing. Yeah, I'm excited to wear that, you know. I think that's going to look really, really nice. And it's so suitable for this time of year. Guys, I'm out of breath, but I've got one last thing. So I love, I'm not the biggest pink fan, but I love pink when it's teamed with red. So I saw this on ASOS and thought, you know what, I'll try you out. I love long sleeve tops like this and the sort of crossed over detailing is exactly what I look for in tops. So I just thought like with a pair of jeans, again, a pair of boots, like I style everything the same way, well kind of, but it's just so easy, like tops like this, you just chuck on a pair of jeans, chuck on a skirt, pair of shoes and you're done. Like, and you still look good, like that's my vibe. And yeah, I think that'll look really, really cute. This would look nice for a Valentine's Day meal, you know, not that we're there yet, but very Valentine's-y. Love it. It's very retro as well, those colours together, I really like them. <sighs> the mess on my floor right now is real. <gasps> now we need to go and tidy it all up. But yeah. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video as well as my last one. Together that has been quite a hefty haul. Um, I'd love to know which pieces you like, which pieces you'd like to see me style. Have you got any? Would you like to get any? I'll try and link things down below. Um, obviously Primark I won't, I won't manage. Um, but yeah, ASOS Topshop, Nasty Gal, I will try my best to find them all and link them for you guys and um, yeah don't forget to like this video and i will see you next time bye